Boris Johnson's decision to axe free NHS prescriptions for the over 60s in England has sparked outrage among many. The charge could come into force as soon as April, while the current £9.35 fee for NHS prescriptions may be hiked at the same time in a double blow to the nation's pensioners. It comes as soaring inflation hits incomes while rising taxes and prices threaten a cost of living crisis. And, as many outraged express.co.uk readers pointed out, prescriptions are set to remain free for everybody in Scotland and Wales. This is despite both their devolved governments receiving payouts from the UK government. Snapper One said, Sounds typical to me. Boris and the Tories are marching to the exit. Mark accordingly raged, the pensioners should revolt. They have hit us hard on pensions backtracking in manifesto promises now this. Whilst the Scots get them free on the back of the British taxpayers. Something, is, not right here. I hope the next GE, general election, comes sooner so we can kick this corrupt line government out. So now OAPs have to pay from their small incomes for medical treatments. It is disgusting. Last year, the government announced plans to lift the qualifying age for free prescriptions in England from 60 to age 66, to bring them into line with the state pension age. It said many people aged from 60 to 65 remain in employment and can therefore afford to meet the cost. Campaign group Prescription Charges Coalition is fighting to rescind the changes. Chair Laura Cockrum warned of the dire impact of the proposals on those living with health conditions, Age UK has called plans to end free NHS prescriptions for the over 60s in England a bitter pill to swallow for millions, Director Carolyn Abrahams said prescriptions are free for everyone in Scotland and Wales and the principle should be extended to England, too.